There is breaking news in the January 6 protest over the bogus election. And what has happened is very interesting. The uh, miles of video footage and other evidence that was withheld by the Democrats uh, has now surfaced. And what that means is everybody who was tried and convicted of any crimes whatsoever during January 6 will be entitled to a new trial and they will be allowed to present the additional evidence. Now, for those people who were bullied into plea agreements because of the harshness the treatment that they were receiving, they knew they were going to get prison terms for essentially maybe at the most trespassing. And so they were bullied into plea agreements. Now they won't have a right necessarily to uh, get a trial and withdraw their plea agreements. Of course, I think that would be appropriate. However, they do have the ability as soon as there's a civilized human being in the White House, which we don't have now, but when that happens, that president will be able to pardon every one of these people because these are federal offenses. They're not state offenses. They're not local offenses. So the president has absolute jurisdiction to pardon each and every one of them. And frankly, that's what should be done. There were so many lies told uh, during these hearings and in court, and it's disgraceful. Our country is in a shambles because of these bastards. Anyway, I'm Paul Hubel reporting for Crime File News.